Hello everyone. I hope you're all having a wonderful day so far. Now then, as usual, going to be a little bit of uh, audio checking just before we get started. There's often someone very helpful who will leave a couple of comments. Well, there's several someones actually who will leave one comment each generally. Um, letting people know who watch the VOD after the fact when the stream actually starts after all of the audio checks. But the first one is, can you all hear me okay? Hopefully. Otherwise, this is going to be a very, very short stream. Well, judging by all the people saying hello in chat, I'm going to take that as an affirmative. The next one then is, can you hear the game? There's not really any music going on right now. There's just kind of like um, ambient sounds, birds, some, some sort of... Uh, Kind of the groaning of old trees in the wind, that sort of thing. All sounds fine so far. The wind is very soft. Yes. Yes, the wind probably should be very soft. Though maybe not that quite that soft. So let's just increase that a little bit, shall we? Bring it up to about there. There we go. The wind should be slightly better. In fact, let me uh, be a little bit more precise with that, in fact. Let me uh, rise that up to about 45% of the uh, normal volume I use. That should be good enough. There you go. Right then. Okay. Now, I've had a lot of uh, technical difficulties today, as some of you may well be aware. And, uh, yeah, so this is probably one of the only things that's going to go up on the channel today. But I think I've kind of solved it for this one game. Uh, there is definitely a need for a new PC, though, uh, or rather, a streaming PC in the very, very near future. Uh, let me see about getting a few things moved over, and then we'll begin. Just going to shoot out a tweet, let other people know that we're going to be streaming, and then we can start. In fact, I'll turn off the starting soon screen, and you can actually see the game a little bit in the background there. That'll be novel for a stream. Go and nope, come on, nope, nope, nope. I don't. I just want hashtag hob, not hobo. Why, why Twitter? You weirdo, my lord. But there we go. Everything should be started now. Okay. Right then. Now, from what I understand, and I haven't actually watched much of this because I wanted to kind of preserve the experience. This is a very well. It. To me, it's probably more along the lines of um, Ori and the Blind Forest, in a way. Um, though with even less dialogue. This game is kind of a, a show, not explain game. Everything, there's no dialogue from what I understand. It's a silent game in terms of um, the protagonist and, and NPCs communicating. But it, as a result, when they want to communicate, they're really emotive about it. So uh, I'm actually looking forward to this. Uh, sure, let's uh, go ahead and start... A new game right about now, I think. Oh dear. Okay, that got a lot, lot louder when we weren't in the main screen. I may have to uh, drop the volume a little tiny bit somewhere, but we'll see how this goes. Very uh, Laputa Castle in the Sky kind of vibe from that golem there. Actually, from everything here. Yeah, we definitely need to drop the uh, volume just a smidgen, because that is a little bit too loud. All right, okay. Let's wander out into the wilderness then. Uh, all right. Looks good so far, from what I can tell. I can jump, I can roll. All things seem reasonable at the moment. Uh, let me just pause the, the video on YouTube. I don't need to see it myself. It's fine. Right, so where are we off to then? Where are we wandering to today? Uh, where did that giant golem friend of mine go? Hello? Hello? Hello, giant golem friend. It's not over there, apparently. I cannot interact with him so far. 
think you can run as well. Ah, there we are. Trigger button. Okay, what do we got down here? Anything much going on? Hello? Is your tail made of a flower? Because frankly, I think that's amazing. Maybe it's a lure. Maybe it lures like insects or something. That's fun. That's absolutely amazing. Oh, thank you very much for the the sponsorship there, Bear. Very kind of you indeed. Uh, we can apparently interact with this if I'm lucky. Uh, no. Okay. Maybe not then. Hello. Okay. Well, we're just gonna wander around a little bit, it seems. Anything else going on down here, perhaps? No, not too much. Yeah, it does kind of, kind of have a bastion feel to it, I agree. I do agree with that, actually. Something in the wall, okay. Oh, there you are. Hello. Uh, okay. What on earth am I doing here? Um, thank you very much. Indeed, I actually don't have my uh, <laughs> my Twitch alert set up, but someone just uh, just offered a gleaming endowment. Apparently, let me go and have a look at what that was. Well, open up you. It's not just uh, tipped five pounds. Hooray for an enjoyable chill stream. Have fun with the game. Oh, thank you very much, Isidore. That's incredibly kind of you. Incredibly kind of you. Okay, well, let's move on. Um, what have we got down here then? I, I took my eyes off the game because someone sent me a tip. What a fool noob mistake that was. Oh, wow, that's, that's pretty. Can I, can I walk? Uh, do I want to test if I... I can, in fact, walk off. Uh, for science. Got to get the science in early. So I don't, don't for science myself at a, at a really inappropriate time later on. Ah, so that was it was actually some sort of checkpoint, I guess. Okay, that's actually pretty cool. Uh, right, let's have a have a wee peek around, shall we? Uh, oh, and thank you very much to uh, Common Dude Two for the subscription over on Twitch. <laughs> that is quite amusing. That uh, OBS is still reporting all of that stuff. I'm, I'm on a different platform at the moment, OBS. Uh, we're not going this way? Can we go this Ah, uh, okay. Well, I suppose I should... Uh, again, for sciencing. I need you to know. Oh, that's funky. Can I get one of those? And one of those. I would use it only, only for peaceful things, of course. Like, you know, chopping down trees and punching holes in walls. For transport purposes alone. I would absolutely not use it for chopping down animals and punching holes in people. You can trust me. I drink tea. I wouldn't lie. I am, in fact, actually drinking tea today. Oh, and thank you so much to Tatsuko for the sponsorship and to Musharak. You are so kind. Oh, I am very, very fortunate to have such a generous and giving community. Ah, gives you gives you the warm fuzzies. In the appropriate place for the warm fuzzies. Uh, hello. I almost lost sight of you there. What are we off to? Ooh, another checkpoint. Yes, please. I accept. Because I'm almost certainly going to full sign something else soon. Uh, apple fumble. Oh my god, I forgot my tea. I made it and I left it downstairs. I, I, I mean, I'm not going to hold it against you, Apple fumble. Because I do that all the time. But uh, you should probably go and get it. Don't worry. You can always... Uh, this is YouTube, after all. You can always like go back like 10 minutes and then just watch on double speed until you're caught up to where the stream is. Uh, whatever that golem did, I'm assuming that was intentional. Hello? Ouch! Ah! They hurt a lot more than the other stuff. Just as well I use, I use these checkpoints so frequently. I'm finding all... I hope you're all writing it down in some, some sort of explorer's journal. Because I'm not for sciencing just for my own sake. I'm for sciencing for posterity. So future generations don't have to, you know, jump face first into brambles. Oh, were you teaching me where I need to go? Oh, that's rather nice of you. Thank you. Oh, such lovely, helpful wildlife. Uh, those look like fish birds. 
I'm liking the game so far. I'm really getting a Lofita Castle in the Sky feel from this, though. Like, massive feel from this. If one of these golems comes up to me holding a little flower, it, it, it's pretty much going to cinch it for me. Hello? Uh, what do we do now? Hmm. Do, do I... I'm not sure I want to jump down. I know what happens when I jump down. It goes bad. It goes really bad. I'm going to look elsewhere. I mean, it might be alright for you. I'm going to go down the stairs. Is this the way I'm meant to go? Do you? Oh, do you want me to stand on this, maybe? Can I? No. Ooh. But there is something down there. Do I just... <sighs> for science? No! Apparently not. Apparently not. Thankfully, there don't seem to be a limited number of lives. Ah. <sighs> Okay. Okay, this is fine. Uh, yes, actually, you know what? With the uh, the subscribe, uh, the, sorry, the sponsors we've got now, I can actually get the Kapoi emote over here as well. Oh, that's going to be good times. Uh, how many sponsors do we have now? It was twenty nine when it started. Uh, so we're we're at uh, thirty two. 30 was the point where I needed to unlock one um, more emoticon, and that'll be Kapoi. And the next one is at 40. So we're eight away from being able to get a brand new one that I'm going to have to get made. It'll probably be a heart with a top hat on it, maybe. Uh, thank you very much, Omega, for the tip there. I have a stream on my birthday weekend. Oh, it's very kind of you. I'm really, really happy that, uh, I mean, you know what, that, that, I like, I like that, the idea that you give someone else something on your birthday, I'm totally on board with that idea, that you make, you, you give them a special memory to remember the, the happy day that you had, it, it's kind of, kind of a, a neat little, little, um, uh, what's the word, uh, tradition that isn't in Britain, but I think it's a is it in Spain or is it in Italy they do that? I'm not sure. Oh, hello. Oh, this is such a cute game. My goodness. Oh, thank you very much, Maton. Oh, that's lovely. Reminds me of the Silt Striders from... Um, oh, what? What? Why? Why so mean? Oh, dear. Oh, no. Oh no, oh no, that, that doesn't look good. Ah, that looks even worse. So that's the cure is worse than the disease. Ah, oh, damn it. Why do I feel that the golem was, was basically my little parent there and is now like, oh no, I took my eyes off it for one minute. One minute. Poor golem. Poor me, obviously, but I do feel for the column as well. The column actually looked panicked. Even I love the, how this game is managing to express emotions without without any kind of dialogue. It's much like Ori in the Blind Forest in that regard. Oh, and thank you very much for the sponsorship, Zell Souse and Waffenhorst. Very kind of you indeed. What did I just see? I mean, that's taking parenting to a whole new level. Or maybe I didn't see it. There's a problem when I stream. I, I kind of find it hard to not spend at least half of my time watching chat. Oh no, I actually did see it. Oh my lord. Yeah, that would probably be my reaction as well. Kind of Hellboyish, honestly. Kind of bad, hasn't it? If we're, if we're being completely truthful here, that looks like an upgrade to me. Though, that also looks incredibly heavy. Oh, I kind of... That was really well done, the way it kind of emoted resignation there. Or at least what I took to be resignation. It's like, oh, great. Now my arm is a giant golem arm. I like my other arm, though. 
I'd spent my whole life getting used to how it works. It was perfectly balanced for what I wanted it to do. <sighs> oh well. Where are we now? Oh, this was the golem's home. Okay. Um. Wait, is what really? Oh, it's got a, like a glowy um bar now. Can I hold? Oh, I can. Oh, that's fantastic. Okay, we'll stop that there then. Is that going to be easy for me to get up there? Oh, can I punch walls now? No. Oh, can I punch it? No, I probably I can't, probably can't punch walls yet at all. Giving gifts on your birthday is a thing in Hobbiton. How marvellous. I wasn't aware of that. I should have been, considering I've... I've well, what? My lord. I... Hmm. Hello? Hello? Can I step on these... I don't want to go near anything that might hide some sort of evil poisonous plant. No? I see what you're up to over there, you scallywag. But I mess for science. No! Come then. Let me see if I can dodge you. Oh. I think it's just warning me. Fair enough. Uh, I mean, you know, at least it's giving me a warning shot first. And I am totally exploring. Probably in the wrong direction. Oh. Yes? No? No? No. Okay. That is a shame. Hello? Aha! Hello there. I have found different secrets. Different secrets. Marvelous secrets. Well, I somehow think I should have found the golem already. Oh, okay, I get what that is. Right, that was the original... Um, that was the original checkpoint I had a long while ago now. That the golem told me to use so ah so you basically switch which one you're checkpointed to can i can i interact with these studs in the wall in any way doesn't look like i can which is a little bit frustrating i can't from what i can tell rotate the camera hmm okay well moving on jim bobbo I have been watching since 2013 Robocraft. Wow, you have been watching almost since the beginning then. I think there's one or two people who've mentioned that they were watching since Faster Than Light, which was the first thing I let played. Which is honestly quite quite humbling when you think about it. It's like they've, they've just been listening to me talking to myself for that long. Oh, can I interact with you now? I've got a robot arm. My robot arm is not nearly as useful as I thought it was. Uh, but I shouldn't say that. That's a bit. That's a bit ungrateful. I'm fairly certain that the golem gave me its robot arm. Ooh. Pretty. Very pretty. Okay. Off we go. Hello, Ryan Jones. How are you doing, mate? And thank you very much, uh, Dot, for the sponsorship. I almost missed that, and I would have felt horrible if I had. Uh, in my defense, it may have been when I recently had my arm attacked by some sort of spiteful flower, and then had it chopped off, and then replaced by someone else's arm. I, I'm still not sure how I feel about that. I think I feel bad, mostly. Bad that I was so bad at, at, at avoiding being hurt that the peaceful Laputa Golem that only wanted to give me a rose more than likely had to chop off his own arm in order to save me. I kind of feel that I brought this on myself. Hello, Joel. How are you doing? Oh, good. I guess that means that I've swapped my checkpoint. I need to go up there. So let me go and jump over here. And up. There we are. Righty-o then. 
Where is the unicorn? Is he over here? No. He's over here. No, I am not going up there. Oh no, did my arm cause that once it was infected? Oh, that would be terrible. No, I want to grab it. There we go. Yoink. Oh, that's very kind of you to say, Joe. Uh, Joel. So kind, in fact, that I, I messed up your name. <sighs> so bad with names. Uh, Alright, let's see. What's going on down here? Can I get through here? Can I... Can I... I can't, I can't seem to, to punch and or cause a sword to erupt from my fist. Hello. Oh. What a kind and helpful golem. I'm fairly certain that golem actually has a rose in its chest. Look closely. I think that's actually a rose growing in its chest and some sort of fern growing out of its shoulder blade. Ooh, what be you? Something interesting. Hello? Ooh, what is this? Hi, Kieran. This game is Hob, and uh, so far you probably know as much as I do from from watching what I'm doing so far. It's It's a bit of a puzzler. Um, there's a bit of platforming involved. There's no real dialogue, but everything is so emotive and, and atmospheric. Oh, you wanted me to get that. Okay. Oh, you gave me your arm so you can't open her up now without me helping. Well, in a way, that's actually kind of sweet. Now you don't have to be alone anymore. We're going to be a team, you and I. Thank you very much. Uh, okay. I uh, will go on. I don't know what you want me to do, but I know that you want me to do it down here. Uh, some sort of foundry? Hello? Oh dear, what have I done? Uh, okay, I... Maybe equipment? May oh, maybe armors or something? No idea, what's this? Hello, Tommy. Uh, you haven't missed much, but uh, again, this is YouTube streaming, so uh, you can actually just go back. If you um, seek back along the timeline, there should be like a, a four-hour buffer. I haven't been streaming for that for long. I've been streaming for about 20 minutes um, to where I start actually playing the game. And then you can probably just watch it on double speed, and you'd be caught up in the next, you know, 12 minutes or so. And then you'd be up to date with everything that's happened. The chat will still be live. Um, so you'll see the chat as it's happening in real time. Um, so you may get like future spoilers if you do it that way. But apparently Mangled Pork does it like that quite often. And it works really, really well. Okay, so... Sword combo, add a third more powerful combo attack, a powerful sprinting attack, improved rolling dodge, uh, mechanical shield, summon a shield from your arm. Oh, that's funky. Uh, apparently they all cost things that I don't have any of. So I'm assuming we go down here. Yes, by the looks of it. Oh, this looks like a smelter. Oh, wow, that smelter works really fast if that's the liquid metal immediately being processed. See, champ, Avak, you sound amazingly funny at twice speed. I imagine that's how a normal, non chill Wales person would talk. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> I've got a sword. Well, it actually looks more like a club. That does not look like it holds an edge. At all. But, can I use it now? Oh, I can. So it's just a, the old one, two. Okay. Pretty cool. It actually feels really, really nice so far. Use glove abilities in something or other. Oh, hello. Oh, a gentle giant with a blooming heart. That's actually quite sweet. 
Uh, what do we do now? You've led me everywhere up to now. Um, no, I'm not going to just destroy. Uh, I don't want to just break things because I can. How about down here, though? Oh, there we go. So, yes, I now have the, the means to cut a path. Still can't seem to do anything over here. Ooh, I could do a jump attack. Oh, that's pretty cool. What about a dash, dash attack? No. Okay, it's not like Dark Souls. I can't do different types of attacks depending on which way I'm moving at the time. Uh, okay. What be you? Can I make that jump, I wonder? Yes, I can. Hello? Ooh. I'm rich! I've got golem backs. Oh, that's fantastic. I will use these golem backs to improve myself. The golems have a rather interesting economy. I like it. Uh, oh, ay, 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 ay. Almost fell off there, my lord. How's your day been, Avak? Anything uh, interesting happen? And how are the cute ferrets? They are fine, Kieran. Thank you very much to, for asking. Though I've spent the vast majority of the day trying to uh, troubleshoot <laughs> some technical difficulties. It seems that in one of Windows 10's... Um, latest big updates or latest last big updates the creator update really did mess with a couple of things for streaming and it it's made it more or less necessary now for me to get a um a second streaming pc and actually have a two pc setup because uh, well as you've already noticed this is not running at 60 fps it is on my computer it's just that obs can't really record because Ah, uh, there's there's a lot of reasons why, um, but it basically comes down to um, Windows is assigning far too many resources to the game that it needs and and um, throttling access of other applications to my graphics cards, so they can't use them even though there's more than enough power to go around to render frames and stream properly. So I'm going to have to fix that. The only way that really makes sense and that is to get another PC. On the plus side, that'll be a massive help to a lot of things because it will mean I'll be able to um, record while rendering because I can move rendering and stuff onto my second PC then. I used to have a setup like that a long time ago. Back when I first started uh, uh, Let's Playing, honestly. Ooh, what am I doing here? Just chilling out. Oh, that's actually quite beautiful. Wow. What the dickens? I feel like something bad just happened. Can I move around? Oh yes, I can. Okay. Uh, right here, so we're going back up. But yes, I used to have a setup like that, and it allowed me to record a lot of things every day. Ooh, can I move across? Oh, I can. Fantastic. But um, yeah, it allowed me to record a lot of things in a day because when I was rendering a video, I could continue recording. Right now, I have to stop and let my computer do what it's doing for like half an hour or an hour, depending. Uh, can I get through here? Is there going to be a button back here? Or is it just... Uh, this will probably just allow me to climb up some way, probably. Can I jump up? Uh, no, I cannot. Can I go back in here? Is there anything for me to jump onto? Hmm. I guess I could go back this way. Not quite. Let me see what I can do. Have I got freedom to move this wherever I want? If I do, I'm going to be very impressed. Oh, I am very impressed. Not many games do that. They usually have little tracks that you can pull something around in. There we go. Now from here, can I jump across? Yes, I can. Marvelous. That's actually really nice. Whoop. Okay. So that's how we get up here. Good. And up we go. Now, are we going to find that little thing that was floating around a moment ago? 
Avak, I think you can disable the gaming mode. Oh, I have. Um, thank you very much, though, for, for that. That was incredibly kind of you to super chat to get that message to me. Um, I, I have um, disabled gaming mode. I've disabled the gaming bar and all of the various other gaming systems. But it's still, whenever a game has focus, then OBS suddenly tanks. with like it, It's around 40 to 30 FPS right now, uh, which is not particularly good. Um, whereas the game is running at, at, at a stable 60. Oh dear. There's baddies down there, I think. Are you baddies? I'm armed, I warn you. Uh, I think they may be. Uh, okay then. Whoop. Okay, they exploded purple. I feel, I feel that they were actually bad. I'm fine. It's all okay. I don't have to feel terrible about what I just did to doggos. Okay, there's all these things all over the world that I can interact with. Oh, hello. What are you doing? I think I'm going to leave you to do it for now. While I explore elsewhere. Is there anything down here? There is... There are things down there. Ooh. What do you... Hello. Oh, no, no. What did I just do? Please tell me I didn't just kill something. Uh, I can check out my abilities. I don't have any yet. Oh, maybe, maybe it's some sort of currency butterfly. Uh, all right, then. We'll see how that goes. Okay. Uh, I have three GPUs, Isildur. Uh, I've got I've set OBS to run at the highest pro uh, process priority and unfortunately it still doesn't make a difference I have spent all day trying to solve this problem and the closest I could get was just a, about a, a small improvement to things by making some other sacrifices and just generally doing a bit of tidying up on my PC that I needed to do anyway are you gonna be like a first boss or are you gonna be someone who I don't need to fight hello Nope. I'd like not to have a fight with you if I can avoid it. I mean, okay, if you're gonna force me. Ouch. That did hurt. Rather you didn't, though. Come on, then. Nope. Ouch. I was gonna say you've got a really predictable attack pattern, and then I just walked straight into it because I'm an idiot. Let's go. You remind me of a creature from a really, really messed up little short animation I once saw called the pier. The way where your your teeth and your your kind of your bite is. Ugh. Why did you remind me about that, dude? Give me nightmares. Or it would have if I hadn't seen worse already. But it it would give any sane person, any unspoiled person, nightmares. Hello. Let's see. Um, I'll check that solution out, Isildur. That might help. Uh, I had looked into the NVIDIA um, center, but I hadn't specifically seen any option like that. So uh, I'll double check that. Thank you. And oop. I'm alive. I'm actually a little bit surprised about that. This looks like some sort of ruined factory in a way. Reminds me of the factories in... Um, so the forges in Zero Dawn. Hello? Hello? Hmm. Broken ladder. Lots of death things down there. No checkpoint yet. Dare I? I mean, I guess I can. It's a very atmospheric game. It's really lovely. Ah, oh, thank goodness, a chat point. Okay. Hello. Can't do anything with you yet. Hmm, what 
is this? Hello? It would appear that this is my objective. Okay, well, I mean, ow, I can only imagine that hurts. And yet, my character doesn't seem to be in pain. Very well. Oh, you just added a new bit. That was actually kind of cool. Oh, you've got the, uh, the wall punch ability now, I think. Oh, that went a bit screwy there. Do apologize. Not sure what happened there. But that looks pretty funky. Now then, let me have a quick look. What are my abilities? Still didn't tell me any abilities. I've got a new bar, like a gauge. That's that. Have I got anything else? Oh, I can. Alright. Um, oh, and it recharged. I was like, I've just used up all of my charge. I think I may have done something dumb. No, no, we can totally do this. Okay. Wow. Wow. How though? I mean, okay, I've got a giant giant golem arm on my shoulder, but it's still I'm still punching from my shoulder. I'm I'm still Every action has an equal and opposite reaction. If I could punch that block so hard that it flew back like that, then I should have had an equal amount of force applied to me. Moving in the opposite direction. This, this, this is voodoo magics. Voodoo magics. These golems are super advanced. They've completely broken science. How marvelous and how terrible at the same time to have that kind of power. Oh, there's a stairs over here. <laughs> Caitlina. Avak. I got here a bit late. Is your character a robot? I honestly don't know. I I think so. But at the same time, I'm not sure. I mean, he had uh, an arm that had to be chopped off. and it, No, no, because for a moment when we were being carried away and our arm was there, it looked like there was meat and bone at the point where, it, like the cross section where it got chopped off. There was meat and bone there. So no, I don't think we are a robot. That that brings it to how did they even get this arm to stick to me? <gasps> the golems are super advanced and super kind and gentle and, and have flowers growing in their hearts, which honestly makes them the best golems ever. Hello. I'm here. Hello, bats. Uh where are we going now? We are going. Oh, right, of course. I can now punch walls. I can punch two walls if I should like. Or I can wander if I would prefer. And I think I prefer to wander. Oh, this goes back the way we came. Never mind then. Going back up this way. Oh, right. I jumped across those pillars. Right, 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 right. Pow. Go away, notifications. I don't want your hugs right now. Go. There we are. You can see the notifications, so it's fine. Tsunami. Uh, hydraulic stabilizers like you'd use on a big gun in From the Depths. Perhaps that's what the upgrade added. Uh, maybe, maybe, yes. Uh, right, let's see. Can we get the camera to rotate? I don't think we can. Oh. I can punch downwards. <gasps> a ground. Does that mean I can do a, a, a hero landing now as well? Can I jump down from impossible heights but ground pound right at the last moment and thus negate all damage? Uh, I'm liking the transforming world. That is actually pretty cool. Let, let's be honest with ourselves. That's awesome. That is pretty bloody awesome. Oh, and thank you, Sheila. <laughs> 
That's so kind of you. You wanted the badge, didn't you? You didn't not like not being able to do all of the uh, the emojis. Okay, I understand. We'll get a Kapoi one up for the next stream. In fact, at the rate that I'm getting new sponsors, we might get two new emojis for the next stream. Okay. This is an interesting place. Let's wander in this direction, shall we? Hmm. You want the Kapoi? Well, maybe I can... I don't know how fast... Like, Because Twitch always had to validate the, the icons, but YouTube seems a little bit faster. Maybe... I could, I could try. Oh, thank you very much for the sponsorship, White Familiar. What a lovely name that is as well. Okay, let's see what this one does. Wapow! Oh, that did a lot more than I was expecting. I may have just collapsed the mountain. Deep down in the depths. Probably changed everything about... You know what? I'm kind of getting a little bit of a Spiral night vibe from this as well. Kind of the idea that the whole world is like ma this massive clockwork mechanism that's just constantly shifting. Oh, such a pretty game, though. I'm really enjoying this. There we go. I'm up, up top. Let me let me cross. Whoa. There we go. And thank you very much, Tom Fish. Oh, you're all being so so generous today. Thank you so much. That's so lovely. Right, I think it would be time to head up here. I think that uh, Streamlabs have been updating some things, so you can now get um, like a, a similar sort of like on-screen alert when people um, sponsor or subscribe or do all sorts of things. Oh, hello. I'm being forced to walk over here. I have no idea what you just said. We want to be over there. Oh. Oh, a map. Thank you very much. What a kind and gentle golem you are. A scholar and a gentleman, I would say. Uh, we can move the map around. Fantastic. We can zoom in or out, maybe. There we go. All right, now we're getting somewhere. There's loads of places back there, though, that I couldn't access because I couldn't punch walls. Hmm. Inventory, abilities. Cool. So I need to go this way. I'm just going to chill out for a while. Okay, I will. I will bring back your arm just as soon as I can, my friend. I promise you. I think we need to... S somehow connect these maybe get some sort of ch like connect a circuit or something and then learn how oh i bet there's going to be some point where we like have power in our arm and we can use that to power that circuit but we're going to have to build the circuit up anything i can do over here probably not yet no okay Thank you very much, Stephen Wolf, for the sponsorship as well. You're all being far, far kinder than I deserve, frankly. Ah, oh, you're all wonderful. Thank you. That's the way I came up, though. So let's uh, go around this way. Yep, Streamlabs can show sponsors, super chats, normal uh, super chats, uh, normal tips, and even standard subscriptions on YouTube. Wonderful. Hello? Ooh, can I use this now? Oh, I can! Ah! Uh. Oh, it's like a vacuum tube for people. How lovely. I thought it was going to upgrade my arm. Ah. Okay. Castle dead. How about you're awesome? Aw. Oh. And that was a beautiful lie, but I appreciate it all the same. I am far from awesome. I strive towards it, though. Uh, all right, let's see. What can I do with all of this cash monies? Mechanical shield. Yes. I will purchase this. Thank you. So, with that, how do I use it, though? No, that's my punch. Mm. 
Aha! There we go. I like it. My arm is a shield. Oh, puzzle adventure games are wonderful. I've got a very, very big soft spot in my heart for point and click adventure games as well, like Myst and and just the the, the whole point and click genre. Uh, I've I've often considered doing a series on some point and click games, but the thing is, is that they're so. Uh, I don't think they they work in the episodic format that that uh, I usually do on YouTube. However, streams, yeah, streams are a different format and might well work. No, can't get through that way, okay. Oh, we can always go this way. Hello? Lots of money. I'd have been able to afford a better upgrade had I held on to my cash earlier. But I didn't. Ah, you horrible, wretched flower, you. I'm not gonna go that way. That's dangerous. Hello? Uh, you can't. I, I can't. I can't snuggle you this time. I'm sorry, you're way too tall. I will find a way to climb up so that I can. I can. snuggle you once again. But, uh, for now, we are born of different worlds, you and I. Okay. Uh, yes, that would be a ghastly turn if the robot got turned evil by the purple stuff. I don't like to imagine that that's going to happen, frankly. That would be a horrible turn of events. Uh, is there anything back here I can interact with? No. I should run around a bit more, but I, I don't know. I'm, I'm not one of these people that is really in a hurry to get where I'm going. I like wandering. Meandering, some might say, because I get to look at everything that way. Okay, we're going up this way. I do wish there were slightly better camera controls, though. That's one one thing I will say. I'd like to be in control of being able to look around more, but then that does... Ooh, that was actually quite fun. That does dramatically increase the amount of work map designers have to do. Hello. Don't you dare. Not even one of you. Thank you. Um, because they have to design, like, ceilings to stuff. They have to, um, like, right now, there might not even be a texture on the back of this wall because the assumption is I'm never going to be able to look there. So it reduces the workload. Uh, you know what? Before I do that, let's go up. I'm like, I'm so glad you're streaming today. You just saved my day. Oh, oh I'm glad I saved your day, though I'm, I'm sad that your day needed saving. But I hope you enjoyed the stream. Okay, we're starting to get somewhere now. I could probably make it over that purple goo. No, uh, well, actually, maybe not. Let's not try it. Let's err on the side of caution today. Hello. Are you a nice person? I do not believe you are, no. Okay then. Uh, let's try this out. Aha! Okay. No, oh, no, oh, oh, I've got a long time before I can recharge you with my shield, it seems. Oh, actually, no. It's not too bad. Really, I chopped his head off. I'm not sure I approve. Oh, actually, no, that was his helmet. Okay. It looks like he's got a really, wow, an enormous jaw. Like, the whole front of him is a jaw. Yikes. Uh, I'm, yes, and having the rotating camera can create a lot more visual bugs as well as just normal bugs that have to do with camera spazzing out on the skybox and such. Yeah, yeah, exactly. So I understand when developers don't do it. But it, it always, like, especially in a pretty game, the prettier a game is, the more I want to be able to take control and just go almost into first person and just look up. So few games let me look up. Sounds silly, but it's true. Ow! I was not fast on the shield there. And then you. 
Yep, they've got enormous jaws. Nope. Thank you. A little bit of health back, please. And some more cash money. It's going to be like like uh, Zelda. Can I get awesome things in the grass? I I don't want this fight to be around the, the innocent little creature there. Thank you. That, that's going to... Yeah, that really took a lot out of me. Come on, then. Thank you. Not around that innocent creature, because you're a little bit wild with your attacks, frankly. There we go. I refuse to be a party to the murder of something that has a flower as a tail. Can I go through there? No. I bet there are going to be some secrets which involve just blindly moving in a direction. Uh, good evening, Duff Duff. Uh, the ferrets are doing very well, thank you. Also, hello, Kenny. Stephen Wolf. Equally, though, Ava, given my small endeavor into game design thus far, some of us designers think, but I will know it's not there and it will bug me. Yeah, I can totally, totally get that. Um, can I maybe punch my way in here? No. Can I punch my way through here? No. Oh, I need to charge up more. Nope. Do I do anything down here? Can't see it. Nope, can't cut you. Can't. Oh, of course. Just walking around, forgetting that I can use platforms. There we go. Oh, this is more of the circuitry. Is there anything I can do with that? I don't know. I have to have a look. Clearly, I need to get to a point where I can interact with these pedestals in some way. Good night, Tatsuku. I hope you have a wonderful evening. And nine, I have no idea what my superhero name would be. I'm not sure that that's even up to me. I don't think we get to choose our own superhero names. Hello. You're going to be aggressive? I'm really glad I didn't take a swipe at you then. Because you weren't. You just looked aggressive for a moment, but you're not. You should always, always check out these sorts of things. Hello, little boar like creature oh dear what on earth was that something oh oh my lord what are you I'm not sure you're something I want to mess with frankly what have we got over here something important that I can't interact with just yet We've got a checkpoint. Good. Good, 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 good. We've also got a way down to death right now. Okay. Captain Dapper. Ah, uh, you know, I, I suppose I can I can live with that. It's a lot better than poor Saitama I got. Uh, nothing back there. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. <gasps> you killed the poor. Th well, I mean, you know, that circle of life kind of stuff. You know, I, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna have a go at you because you need to eat. I will have a go at you because you'll eat me if I don't. But other than that, that's you know, it's pretty normal. Hello. Oh, there's a way back here. Kind of amazing things. <gasps> oh, I bet I know what I can do here. Ready? Ah. Oh, fantastic. I approve. They're up top. But I am down here. I can see it up there. It's, it's shadow, and I'm watching it. 
Oh, that's glorious. Hello, uh, Chris Butler. How are you doing? Hello. Nothing too bad down here. Hi, Aiden. Okay, we come all the way back up. So that was just a little detour to get some cash money. Pomp. All right, then. I fear that you and I are going to have to have a falling out, aren't we? Yeah, probably. Oh, that was not what I meant to do. But you know what? It might work. Come hither. Come at me. Not sure if that does more damage than my sword does. Ah, I completely mistimed that. I would say yes, I am a person because I explode in gibbs. Well, now. I see that I may have made a slight mistake. Uh, right, okay. Let's see. Is everything back here that was here before? I'm not sure. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Ah, uh, okay, we've already gone through there. That was just, that was just crazy. That was flat out, I'm just going to pummel you into the ground. That's pretty good time for me, though. Punches in the back. No, ow. Okay, you, even the swipe will kill me straight up. Okay. Very well. Rachel Sega just donated. Hi, Alvac, I'm a huge fan watching your hob stream. Thought you deserved the tip. I've been binge watching your videos for months now, especially a fan of your Rimworld and Stellaris Let's Plays. Have a great day. Oh, thank you very much. That's incredibly kind of you to say. As it happens, I am strongly considering starting a new Stellaris uh, Let's Play. Um, in, I was actually pretty close to starting it today, except then my day got used up trying to solve problems. Okay, then. Looks like we need to have a proper fight with swords and clubs and stuff. Nope. And then massive slash attack. I'm just going to have to be... Conserve my attacks. And by conserve, I mean not go for a triple attack. That is never a good idea. If I've learned anything from Dark Souls, it's don't do things like that. Two is enough. Anything more than that is just greedy. So I'm going to go for a greedy shot there. Haha! Because -ha, I got a gleaming endowment. That makes me feel bold. Haha! -ha! I completely believe that I defeated you because of the... Oh my lord, yeah. Um, Striker. No message. It's too late to think of one. 17 pounds and 62 pence, though. That's all the message you need. Thank you so much. That is incredibly generous of you. Oh my lord. I've said before, and I will say again, I have an, a fantastically generous community. Oh, and I'm very, very thankful for it. Uh, okay, well, we've slain a scallywag, but I'm not sure what I need to do now. Is that it? Did I just need to slay the scallywag? Well, I'm okay with that, I guess, but I was expecting a little more. Maybe I'll have unlocked something new I can do. Hello, tree talk. Tree talk, rather. I, I have no idea why why YouTube's like no, no. This this is this is potentially offensive. Hide it. All you did was say hello. Maybe maybe it took took exception to the to the uh, implied accent you were using. Who knew? Who knew that the humble salt of the earth hello was offensive to some? My goodness. Oh wait. Hello? Or hello? Oh. Oh, that's incredibly cute. That is more or less how I how I interact with the fans, yes. Do you want me to follow? Maybe. Or maybe you don't. I'm not sure. 
I have no idea. Hmm. But that was actually incredibly sweet if it was just a random thing that you can do. Well then, I've come all the way over here. Let me have a quick look on my map. Uh, I don't see anything else I need to do here right now. Hmm. Okay, well, time for me to wander around. Time for a little bit more exploration then. Well, I'll be back here. We've already explored this as much as we can. Just in case something changed up top. Let, let me down. Let me down. Good. Can I jump over this? No. Um, without that crazy monster slamming the grate all the time up top? Anything changed? No. Nothing has changed. Very well. Hello, Oba. And I make the jump. Uh, no. Uh huh. Okay. Well, I guess we simply go onwards. Whatever upwards, perhaps. Or maybe even downwards on occasion. Whatever we do, we, we need to do it now. Uh, we don't want to go down there. That would be not fun times for anyone, especially us. Can't jump up there, despite it looking like there's a handhold. Can I interact? No. Can I interact? No. Very certain we came from this direction. So let's uh, go up instead of down at this little junction here, because maybe that's the uh, that's the difference. What are we going to find back here? Okay, yeah, this is a new area. And we pro- yeah, we went around. Ah, okay, I got you all. We're back on the track, everyone. Hello. No. Absolutely not. You're naughty. Both of you. I can seem to swing this forever without ever having to slow down. Except occasionally I will get hit because my timing is terrible and my reach is, is short. There we go. Okay, so just mashing the attack button is a thing you can do because you don't have like a stamina gauge or anything, but probably not something you want to do. I feel like listening to you talk and watching you play this game is a good backdrop to spinning some yarn. By all means. I can punch the brambles. Really? I feel like you're tricking me, but okay. Ow! You were, in fact, tricking me. See, champ, you scallywag, you. Oh, was it? Oh, yes, it was a question mark. Sorry. <laughs> I apologize. That was my fault. I thought it was an exclamation mark. It was a question mark. I apologize, see, champ. I was the, the scallywag all along. Who knew? Uh, sure, let's get through here. And also over here as well, because why not? I need to charge up them. Hello. I will accept your golem bucks. Hello, Silt Walker. Silt Strider, rather. Oh, that's very kind of you, Kit Catherine. A small thank you for being so lovely. Oh, You're the one who's lovely. What a, lo what a charming compliment. Thank you. I want to go back and, and talk with the Silt Striders. Oh, well, it doesn't look like I can. Right. What are we going to do now? There's a, a bud there. Ah, it's like, no, get away from my bud. It's my bud. Okay, fair enough. I am really hurt now. <laughs> I am soon to, to be not alive, I fancy. My aliveness is about to go down very sharply. Oh. Oh. 
Yes, of course. Now we can get up here a little bit easier. Uh, hello. Come on, then. Come at me, bro. Aha, you fool! You came at me! Ah, will they never learn? Hello? Oh! That's a little bit more violent than I was expecting. But all right. Wow. And I, I just smashed it anyway. That felt like I was making I was making a statement. I was punishing that plant for all the other times of brambles and, and plants had hurt me, including that weird purple plant that tried to eat my arm, but then didn't eat my arm and instead infected my arm. So my arm got chopped off. Because it was the only way to save my life. <sighs> I don't feel even remotely bad about the violent death of that of that bramble now. I feel vindicated, in fact. Ooh. Hello? Yes. How oh, marvelous. So many new ways I can go. I like the fact that there's places for me to go back to. And kind of rewarding my exploration that I know to go back there. Hello. Got to go wherever. Got to be up for work. Hope the stream goes well. And I will be waiting for the next. Oh, take care, Kieran. This will automatically go up onto YouTube. Um, so you'll be able to watch the VODs after the fact. And again, I, I do apologize for it being slightly lower quality than my usual uploads. I will I will get that sorted. Just going to need some time to look into everything and decide on PC parts and all of that good stuff. Because you can't rush building a PC. You certainly can't just buy a PC. No, no, no. Not at least when you enjoy building them as much as I do. I mean, there's no there's no problem with just buying one if, you, if you're not... Uh, not into building PCs, but I I consider it uh, quite quite a pleasure. Hello. What have we got up here? Anything new and wonderful and, and marvelous in all sorts of ways? No. Oh, uh, I guess that's how I would get over here if I wanted. I I I I if I wanted to activate that, but I don't know how to do that yet. Mick, for the tea fund. Oh, thank you so much. That's very kind of you. I will get like the the sort of stream overlays and all of that good stuff on here as well at some point. Uh, you are glowing. Uh, it is just the fact that you are um, in the sun. Never mind then. Wait a second. Can we do anything over here? Uh, doesn't look like. Okay. I'll take that into consideration. What I'll probably do is I might even post a, a little video asking for advice. Because I'm, you know, as much as I enjoy building a PC, I'm certainly not the, uh, I don't, I don't nearly have enough time. Not even close to enough time. What on earth is back here? This feels like a trap. I'm very glad that it wasn't. But I don't have nearly enough time to uh, search for a, and keep up with all of the latest developments. So um, there will be lots of people who will know better what parts are good for for certain situations. So I will rely on your knowledge. I will I will steal your know-how. Make it my own. Thankfully, it will not involve having to eat your brain. Which I believe is the only other way to steal someone's know-how. Since you can just comment on YouTube. YouTube, saving brains since 2017 and I just decided that the only other way is to eat them uh, right we can't go in there where are we going then well, we've got the sword foundry over there we've got a something I think I'm gonna need to use just down here a little ways let's go to the sword foundry might be able to uh, upgrade a couple of things Alts and swords. Yes, yeah, this way. There we go. Hello. I don't think I actually need to touch that. I think I just need to get near it. 
As long as it's opened up, then it's telling me that the uh, checkpoint has been switched. <laughs> we keep going into Dark Havoc area. Yeah, you're never too far away from Dark Havoc area, really. Did I complete Pillars of Eternity? And if not, do you intend to, on doing so? I do intend to do so. I have not yet, though. Sword combo. Add a third, more powerful attack combo. Powerful sprinting attack. Improve rolling dodge. Uh, I'd actually like the sword thrust, honestly. Let's go with that. That'll allow me to get back into a fight if I've been knocked back a little ways. Can I test this out? How does one do that, then? Uh, abilities. Can you tell me about it? Oh. Ah, I've got to be actually sprinting. Okay, that makes a lot of sense. Got nothing to do there. Fair enough. Okay. Onwards. And upwards, in fact. Let's be moving out. Uh, oh, Michael asked something about whales. Uh, I'm back in Lady Shiav. I'm going to be living in the UK pretty soon. I've been to England and Scotland. I was wondering if you could recommend, uh, recommend a nice place in Wales. Uh, it depends on the sort of things that you want access to. Um, obviously, Cardiff is a city. And is a, a nice city as, as far as cities go. It's quite vibrant. Um... It's growing very quickly, so there's there's a real sense of of energy in the city. Um, but if you're more, you want to be in the countryside. Um, there's a couple of other places that you could consider. Um, it's a bit of a broad question, though, so shoot me an email, and I'll see what I can do about giving you some places that you can at least look into. If you let me know what kind of um, what sort of place you're, you're wanting to live and for how long and that kind of thing. Right. Okay. Well, time for us to go this direction. Hello. Sprite Cloak. Boosts speed but reduces health and energy. Oh. So that'll be something I can wear now. Okay. Well, let's go and actually put that on. Let's go and see what we look like with that equipped. Should have grabbed that before. Damn it! I thought that was gonna be like the the way to the next area, and it turned out it's like no, no, no. This is this is the chest. Ah, oh, you okay, fine. But someone should just mention that we need to go down the uh, vacuum tube, so uh, we'll try that in a moment. Oh, right, right, you're just looking for a place to visit. Oh, okay. Well, I can, I can get you quite a few suggestions on that one then. But yeah, let me know what kind of things you're interested in, and I might be able to help. Uh, oh. Hmm. I was really certain that that was going to be what I needed to go. Uh, okay, so how does one do that then? Do I just activate it? Is there a button I just pressed to turn it on? Not by the looks of it. Okay. Interesting. Oh, okay, I see. Oh, wow, that costs a lot. Wow, that costs a lot. Okay. We're not going to be getting that for a little while. Hi back, fan from Texas. Any plans on revisiting Cataclysm? It's one of my favorite. Yes. Yes. Very, very big plans. Either as a streaming series. So, um, like, I'll play it through, but it'll be played through exclusively on stream or an actual regular series. I'm not sure yet. We'll see. The pro of a regular series is it. Can I, can I move around? I can't seem to move around. I think I've got to get to that. Uh, 
a little marker on my map. The the one that looks like uh, a bird or something. But uh, the pro with the regular series is I can cut out all of the minutia and boring parts like inventory management sort of things around because i mean to be fair cataclysm has a lot of that at least if you're playing it with the intent to get to the end game stuff to do all the really cool build building vehicles because sometimes you just need to go out and you need to take apart like eight vehicles down to the the the, the frame literally need you to scavenge everything and that can take like four or five days in game of you just going out grabbing everything and returning to get some food so on and so forth um, so, I'm not sure yet on which way I'm going to go with that. Let's head down this way. No, we can't. We need to go around then. Still can't get in there quite yet. Um, still can't quite up. Okay, there we go. Ow, you almost got me. Cheeky. All right, was it in here we needed to get to? Maybe getting up is what we needed to do. Hmm. Have a little, another bit of a look around. Just make sure I got the lay of the land. But I think, oh, can I jump through? No, that is a bit of a shame. Okay. Hmm. See, champ, you've made my day. <laughs> Seems that we've got quite a few Cataclysm fans in here today. I've got to strike a good balance though between newer, uh, like newer content on the channel and revisiting old series. That is one thing I'm, I'm going to have to say. Streams kind of release me from that a little bit. In that, it doesn't really matter what I stream. Um, because it's just something I do. I pop up on the channel. I mean, with YouTube streams, it's a little, it matters a little bit more since there's um, quite a lot of crossover because the streams become um, VODs and, and the VODs have the same sort of uh, effect on channel growth and, and um, advertising and that sort of thing as uh, regular videos. But I really need to get in there. I cannot see how. Can't climb up you. Can't climb up you. Oh, maybe. Maybe. No, yes. No. No, I don't think so. I don't think I can just jump from those things. Can't get over there. Have I gone stream and a cat sleeping on my lap during a rainstorm? Oh wow, Douglas, that that actually sounds pretty awesome as far as awesome things go. That that is way up there. I need to get up on the walls, I think. Unless I can do something back here. No, can't get through there. Can you help me over? No, maybe not. Mm -mm -mm. Okay. Ouch. Why be so mean? Ouch, ouch. Ah, dead. And I explode just for, you know, just for good measure. Hmm. I'm at a loss as to how to get up there. I was meant to come back this way, I think. Maybe... Can I climb up there? Is there something I can do? Let's visit the places I've previously been. Let's have a have a proper look around. See if there's anything I've missed. Up here. Endowment. Following you quite a while now. Just wanted to say thank you for your great content. Greetings from Germany. Oh, thank you very much. Greetings from Scotland. Or rather, greetings from Wales via Scotland, I suppose I could say. Oh! Of course. Aha! There we go. Progress! 
Hello, ancient automaton. What? That is not an acceptable thing to do to... to uh, what? I'm disappointed in you, Hob. So disappointed. Maybe that is a power charge, though. Maybe I've got, like, one charge. Incredibly rude. I'm glad that the, the rest of you agree. You just don't do that. Even if it, it does have some sort of, like, massive battery inside its face that I really, really need. This is just wrong. So rude. Let's go find my golem friend. Actually, where is my golem friend? Hmm. There's a couple of things open up now. Okay. Let's zoom in, shall we? There's quite a lot of things opened up on the map. Uh Oh, no, no, no. You know what? Probably that, that charge builds up over time. And that's like the, the pieces of my heart. That That's probably not like electricity. That's probably more like I can punch twice in a row. It was it was definitely a dark havoc move. 100%. That was, that was, it was, there was no getting away from that. That was super bad. Oh. Let's continue having a look around, though. There's going to be a path. I've just not found it. It's not the game's fault. It's mine. I'm not seeing something. Nothing back here. Hello? Anything over here? New. No. Fairly certain that in... Oh, actually, at the top here is one of the things I need. Oh, that's the flower. Okay. So I know what that is. I know that there's some money up there. Hello. There's an angel kind of statue thing over there. Let's go up and go and have an investigate. Hello. Sorry, I almost crushed you there, little bird. Oh. Can I... Can I maybe... Punch it? No. It looked blue for a moment, like it was it was ready to be activated, but no. Alas, it was not meant to be. Yeah, we're back we're back here again. This is the place I need to get into. So many things that need to connect up in some way. Can I just interact with this perhaps? Nope. Nope. No interaction possible. Hmm. Okay. And yes, Dan, I have seen Theodore Shattering. Um, Muha, one of my favorite devs, and Theodore is one of my favorite games. So uh, I, was, I was very much all over it when they announced the Kickstarter for that. I'm really hoping that we can get up to the uh, extra um, levels on it. The... Um, what are they called? The stretch goals. Because it would be quite nice to have uh, some extra voice acting. I really think the the narrator did a fantastic job in the first game. But I, I definitely uh, approve of getting a female voice actor in there as well. Oh. 
Okay. I wonder. Can I like throw myself up there? No. Can I run? No. Can I jump? Can I jump around? Yes. Ha 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 ha. I think I've made progress. I think I've made progress. Oh, progress has been achieved. Ah, never. What way does what? Wait, no, what? How? What? How did I miss you? How is it possible that I missed you? Well then. Now don't I feel like a derp. Uh, the Kickstarter for Thea 2 The Shattering. I've actually supported it. I've only supported two Kickstarters in in my time. And uh, it is the second. The first one was Planetary Annihilation. Because I'm a massive um, Supreme Commander. And uh, Total Annihilation specifically. Okay, that doesn't really do anything. It must need a power and then it becomes some sort of uh, bridge. But I'm a massive Supreme Commander and Total Annihilation fan. And uh, the idea of, of just just even the concept work just blew me away. Um, beyond that, I've su I've supported so yeah, and I, both times I've supported them a fairly hefty amount because it's not just me buying a game in advance. I really want to make sure that this thing gets done, and I also want to send a signal to other developers that look, these are the sorts of games I want to see, and hopefully there's a, lots of other people like me, so take risks on these kinds of genres, because there is a market for them, because sometimes especially publishers, they can be a little bit risk averse well then where to go now is that the lo little location up top that I can't get through I don't think, uh, apparently we've got an indicator back over there We've got some sort of thing down there. There's a couple of places we can go that we haven't already been. So now I've actually achieved this part here. I'm going to be a little bit happy with trying to get elsewhere. So let's go along. See what there is to see. Did I really just never come through here? Did I just turn away from this or something? So that is remarkably dumb of me if I did. Oh well. Onwards. Into a new biome, it looks like. Is there anything back here? Because you gotta be thorough. I'm almost certain. Uh radio. I'm going to guess that that is death. That is auto death. You are now dead. Rip you. And we have unlocked the tripod cube. Oh, well, that's actually quite kind of useful because I wanted to go back and see this anyway. Since it's currently showing up. Now, I'm fairly certain it's only showing up because I have a sword piece. But, um, let's go in and see if it'll stop being highlighted once I visit in and deposit that. Ah, uh, yeah, I probably was really dumb. Sorry, Zangiri. I like the music in this game. It's really quite atmospheric. It's really cool. Oh, I'm sorry, Yuzeldor. Oops. Alright, what did I want to have a look at? Is there a way for me through here? Yeah, there's a couple of more places that I'd like to explore, Daniel. Hello. My golem friend. More places back here. I'm assuming that I cannot yet open that up. Okay, that's fine then. So that one's removed from a list of places I'm going to try and get to. Down here, however. I wonder, could we just jump down there, I wonder? Like, I'm very curious. I might hurt myself, but I'll give it a try. Oh, death. Yep. Not too surprised, really. 
Not too surprised. Down there, there's something hidden in that little area. I think we're going to need to get a means to kill off this uh, sort of corruption first, though. But I'll just double check it just so I can kind of tick it off places to visit. Uh, we can't get through there. Can we get up here? No. We cannot. Doesn't appear that getting up there is going to be on our agenda for now. All right, then. It's good enough for me for now. We've seen that we're not able to get over there. There may be one or two things back there that I can have a look at. Um, in fact, there's one on the map that looks really accessible. That was very silly of me. Uh, really accessible. If I didn't rush. And then that will be uh, the last of it done for me then. Now we can go into the new biome. Oh, you don't have to sponsor me, Z Wolfer. It's it's more than enough to just know that you want to. I actually want to be over there, going through that wall there. So I'll just drop down here, then go this way. Oh, we're on the wrong side. Why do I keep making this mistake? I want to be the other side. Damn it, now I've got to go all the way around. Actually, I might be able to uh, take a shortcut back. Can I punch this? No. Makes me a bit sad, but let's see. I splatted. Maybe one day I'll be able to make a jump like that and not immediately splat, but it was worth finding out, actually, because I had wondered if I could clear all of the, the corruption in one jump. It appears the answer to that question is yes. Yes, you can. Okay, we kind of got a long wander ahead of us to get back there. Bit of a potch, but it's not terribly bad. It'll, it'll just be this little area that I never went to and didn't discover on my map. But it, there's nothing there. I'm calling it now. It's going to be a complete wild goose chase, but... I'll feel better for having my, my map completely revealed. I'll feel a lot better for that. I want to go this way. There we go. Now we just need to find our way down here. There we are. Does any of you want a hug? No? No, no hugs for you. None of you want hugs. Very well. Now, what was it down here? There was the button that we could not press. This one leads up to... That looks like it's got a mouth. That growth over there actually looks like it's got a mouth and wiggly hair. That's a little bit disturbing. Hello. Nothing too much in here. Oh, this is where the golem first took us, actually. So yeah, we've just gone round in a big old circle. Uh, back here... We're still not at the part that I'm looking at, unfortunately. Up there is where I want to be. If I can get there, it doesn't look like I can. No, no, it's a little bit too high. Okay. Well, I'm fairly confident that we've explored this whole area to the... Oh, hello. Can I talk with you? No! No! That's not what I wanted to do. Uh, I was worried that it wasn't showing any kind of, um, you know, press X here, but it was completely calm. It's like, oh, it, wouldn't, it wouldn't do that to me, but it wouldn't make me accidentally knife something. Oh, yes, it bloody well would. Uh, thankfully, the poor thing had the common sense to run away the moment I pulled my sword out. Okay. 
Hello, can I talk to you? Avac, yep. Avac 2017. Talk with my sword. Because I'm a scallywag. And we need to go this way. On the plus side, it is much faster for us to get through here. Now then, how do I get up to the biome point there? There we are, and around, and up. There we go, we are now in the new area again. Or I could have used the tube, I suppose, but... Uh, can you link me? Thank you. I can only assume this is going to hurt. Yep, yep. I had to for science it, though. It is necessary. Nope. Please, nope. Please stop being better at combat than I am. I'm going to have to be wary of attacking you too aggressively. I need to take my time with those ones, it seems. Oh dear. I appear to have a hold. I can't see what I'm doing anymore. Okay. I've actually got it under control, I think. Oof. We could fall down there. Can I climb this? Yes, I can. Marvelous. Can I do anything now I'm up here? No. Not as marvelous. Oh, I'd probably t power that up, I see. Oh, wow, that's powerful. Either that or I'd already really hurt that uh, creature. Come here, you. Yeah. Kind of assumed that was what was going to happen. Alright, well, let's drop down here then. Seems like the obvious place. Also, a bit of an awkward camera angle, but more monies. Hello, Lost Centurion. How's it going, mate? Actually, what we got over here? Nothing. Okay, fine. Okay, so that's just given us access to an area we already had access to. Um, can I jump up there? No. Can I avoid all... Oh, hello. I kind of feel bad, though. Thank you. Um, Dan, I'm fairly certain I would, in fact, die by jumping into the giant swirling electric vortex of doom, yes. Oops. Hello? What do I do here? That's probably an elevator of some sort. I carry it around. I was waiting for my character to put it into his inventory. Okay. Swanky. Oh, very swanky. Swanky back there? No. Alright. Well, we've opened up a gate. Nothing else. Oh, hello. Ah! 
I'm gonna guess that the only time I'm gonna be able to hit you is when you are coming at me face on. Nope. Oh, then. Aha! Okay. Now, these are currently turned on. These aren't electrocute me. And then. Ah, that hurt. And this way. Into the electrifying stuff. Oh, really? You don't care electrifying? Well, that's just unfair. Over here then, mate. And out the way at the last moment. Ah, you skywag. How am I meant to get rid of you? Come this way then. Oh, I wonder. I wonder if I can just punch you. Oh, I can! Glorious. Oh. Nope. Can't just randomly do it then. I need to get a full charge for it to be effective. Damn it. Oh, thank. Oh, right. The cogs are what took it off because it's an uneven surface. I see. That makes sense. I should have realized that. Okay, well, what's back here then? More corruption. Lots more corruption. Some lightning recently. The stairs. Okay, let's go and check this out. Alright, for science, the swirling electric vortex, you know it it could make you a superhuman. Uh, I feel like you're leading me astray. Just like all the people who kept wanting to toast on the last stream. On, um, yeah, it was yesterday. Kept insisting that I join them in toast. Well, they didn't really insist. They just said, I'm toasting this. And then I was like, oh, okay, I guess I've got to toast then. So, you know, toasting alone because that would be rude. Ouch. Into the cacti. Or, you know, your friend. I also accept that. Uh. Ground types are immune to electrical attacks. You know that, Abak. Uh, how could I have forgotten? What a jerk, eh? Ah, this is a place that needs a battery. Okay. So I'm going to need to get a battery back here then. You get a battery over here? We can absolutely fall off this thing. We are not careful. Thank you. Isildur, a toast to two friends and good. Ah, Isildur. No. Oh. Not gonna. Not this time. I've got face cam on. You wouldn't be able to prove. You wouldn't be able to be certain I was. I was drinking mead anyway. Be a wasted effort. Ah. Okay. Don't just jump down with those things. I got you. All right to you. Would like another one, please. So that's why we've got the very, very gentle incline all the way down. Because these things are very volatile. Oh, thank you very much, Jennifer. That's very kind of you. Oh, we've opened up a new path. Marvellous. I love how the world changes as you explore more. 
Like, rather than just opening new paths, you're, you're creating new paths. That is actually pretty cool. Oops, wrong one. We Actually, do I really want to be down here? I'm not sure I do, frankly. Not at all sure I do. Well, actually, I suppose I must. Ah, I don't want to be there, though. Damn you and your pincer attacks. Okay, that one took a little bit of damage from the cacti, I think. And you as well. There was one in the long grass that they had raptors. Hiding in the long grass. Ouch! Uh oh. here what kind of strangeness is this I'm doing very well thank you Jennifer how about yourself Actually, it's a, well, it's a step up from the last area, which was far more violent, but... Okay. Guess this is a one-way trip for now. Might be a boss down here, or just something I need to unlock to make progress. Can I break my way through here? No, I don't think so. Oh, I get an arm upgrade. Okay. <laughs> Happy times. Well, I'm glad to hear it, Jennifer. What? So is this what is uh, how do I use this? Oh no! No, that was not what I meant to do! No Why? Why game? Why did you give me this horrible power? Myself. <sighs> I'm not a good person. I'm a bad person. Okay, well, let's go up this way that it wanted me to go. Run away, bats. I'm not safe to be around. A scallywag. The scalliest of wags, in fact. Oh. That's how it works. I see. So I didn't need to try an experiment, I just needed to, you know, not kill everyone. Uh, okay. It feels so bad. We've gotten so far without without murdering any innocent creatures. Okay, well at least now we can use all of these areas. Come on, we gotta get up there quickly. It's ticking down. Ah oh, just in the nick of time. No, you're not a washing duck. I don't. 
Scallywags. Don't invoke dog Africa. This is a cute game. Even if occasionally it does involve accidentally ground pounding an innocent creature into Gibbs on the floor. Okay, so. Wow. Okay, well that was, that was quite a ride actually. My lord. I switched around what um, what was getting the power from here. That's pretty cool. Let me let me up. No, no, don't want to go back down. Thank you. <gasps> oh my lord! Haha! -ha! Take that! You're not innocent creatures. I can I can stomp you. Best unlock ever. Oh my lord! You know what? I'm not gonna just kill you. I killed the others because they were attacking me. I'm not just going to randomly chase you guys down. That would just be, that's just cruelty for the sake of it. Can I stop doing stuff here? I'm assuming this is like a docking spot. There we go. It would be far too scallywaggery for me to just run these guys down and kill them. No. I refuse. What's it gonna do? Oh. I see. So I've moved that around a wee bit. Ah. Cool. Also. With great power comes great responsibility. Ah, let's just kill some stuff. No. No. You must resist. No, oh, please. Killing them is fine because they're grassing me. They were just running for their lives. There's no honor to be had in that kind of battle. Ah. Oh, dear. What are you doing? What? You, you've got magic now! You can teleport too? This is... This is actually kind of awesome, but also terribly frightening. Nope. Oh. Okay, you Before I get wiped out. Okay. No, 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 no. No. Ay, 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 That was bad. Don't approve your magical shenanigans. No, absolutely not. Ugh. Oh, you create more of them as you go. Wait a second, are these things being born by the lightning? My goodness, that's terrifying. Oh, have I taken away their magical powers now? I wonder. You come down here? You might be, actually. I mean, you can go to plenty of places to get magical energy, I think. Uh, okay, well, that's kind of an interesting fight there. Do I really want to get to... I do, actually. Only issue is, I can't easily fight you now unless you come down. This away, please. Come here, then. Come on. Be brave. Go to the place where you have no power. Come on. You know you want him. No? Absolutely not. Really like it if you would, though. I may have done a silly by by removing that item. 
So I think they're like, like, well, why would I go there now? Come on, don't be dumb. There's nothing there for them. Should have killed them while they were down here and enjoyed being here. Oh, I can get up. Ha 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 ha. Your sanctuaries are not quite as safe as you once thought. Oh, oh dear, oh dear. I'm I'm in bad places. I am indeed in bad places. Nope. I have I have gotten sanctuary of my own. No. Nope. Ah. I need health orbs. Thank you. Okay then, what are you gonna do? Make your move. Yep. Ouch. Man, I wish you wouldn't have done that, honestly. Oh my lord. I almost got hit by lightning. You know what I should have done? Is I should have gone rid of those two first and then left them the only place they could go down the bottom. That would have made a lot more sense. Because now trying to fight them up on that surface is going to be really hard. Ah, oh, pretty. You know, as lightning strikes right behind me. Good times. I could go down there to avoid almost certain death, but... I feel that I really do need to sort you out. And that is going to involve getting up here. No, oh, I can't make it. Hmm. Oh, I see. I see. I just wasn't looking right. Nope. Not happening. Not today. Oh, my lord. I wasn't sure I was going to be able to do that fight. But hooray. Hooray for us and perseverance. Hello. You just here so I can see things? Hmm. Maybe you were. Very well. I need to go back and spend some of my uh, coins soon, actually. Again, the distinct impression that I should do that soon. Very, very soon. Uh, Alright, well, we can jump down here, I guess. Or I can go back the other way and not have to... Ouch! Not have to murder you all. Uh, additionally, I can just walk this way. Not get struck by lightning. Ideally. And just check out a little, little area back here. Hello? Schematic Vowel. Punch upgrade increases punch damage. Ooh, okay. But that'll cost a redonkulous amount of money to get, unfortunately. Also, what on earth would it be useful for? Is the question that comes to my mind. Like, will it mean we can punch through different things now? Either way. Let's be on the move. Alternatively, I could jump down and explore that little area over there, though for now, I would very much like to go and head up. Uh, sorry, head back to the main base. Yep. Need to go back and see if I can't get an upgrade. Am I a cyborg or a robot? I think technically I'm a cyborg now. But when I die, I do explode into meaty chunks, so. Uh, 60, actually. That's not too bad. Um, sword combo, improved agility. 
think I kind of want to hold out for that one. The more powerful sword combo. Sure, okay. We'll go for the more powerful sword combo. Just because I would like a little bit more lethality. Oh, okay. A bit of a fancy back sword combo. Got to have a little bit of time between them, though. You can't just mash, because otherwise it's just as fast as you can go. All right. That's kind of interesting. There's actually a couple of places nearby in that area that I can now access, I think. But we're quite close to the area that we need to be. That, um, that like the area that the golem kind of highlighted for us on the map. So let's try and get there, shall we? I wonder what will happen if we try to get through there. Oh, we can't. Okay, I guess that answers that question then, doesn't it? Flee, flee. I don't want to have to fight you when I get off this thing. Oh, we can actually dock it wherever. Oh, that's useful. That's very useful. Anything interesting back here? Ooh, an arm upgrade. I think... No, actually, that's what we turned on. I get you. Uh, hmm. Well, strictly speaking, we want to kind of go up there. Oh, I can see what we need to do. We need to position this in such a way that we can get onto that ladder. And that is also the first time that the game has done anything uh, kind of cheap with the movements. Because I just teleported to where the controls were. Usually it, it enforces that I have to walk there, or if I try to activate the controls from the wrong side, my character will walk around to the controls, but in that instance, they uh, they just teleported to where the, they needed to be stood for the controls to work. I do like that we actually have lightning rods up here to protect me, because <laughs> otherwise this would be dangerous. Very dangerous. Okay, what are you then? No, why? I, I, I don't really have an explanation of why that happened. Other than I'm a dip. But, uh, you know, it's a thing that happened. And I stand by it, I guess. Alright, let's uh, actually go down. Now, one of the tricky things with the ladders is when you're going up a ladder. Even though you walk, like right now, what makes sense to me is to walk into the ladder to go up. The moment you're on the ladder, it's up and down that moves you around, even though when you're on the ground, up and down just make you go that way and that way. And that's kind of why that went all kind of screw with. Right, let's go down here. Oi! That's quite fun. I'll be in here. I need to move something in there, I think. Or over there, possibly. All right. I bet that thing is going to be this. It's going to be a battery, isn't it? Oh, I can just climb up if I want to. Can I activate this? No. Uh, okay. Let's have a quick look around see what I'm going to be doing before I do it. Okay. Nope. I'm really, really enjoying this game. Really, really fun. Oh! Oh. Ah, okay. I can probably push this. Hmm. Alright. How do I get across then? Huh. I can't seem to move it. Curious. Very curious. Um, do I have to activate that? 
I'm actually not sure what I need to do here. Like, at all, because I can't move it all the way back. Oh, I see you up there. So, how the question is, how do I get to you? Oh. That's the answer, I guess. Well, that's unfortunate, because I'm not sure how I can deal with that. It keeps this charged, even though it's been... I am not sure what I need to do here, because I'm fairly certain this is going to hurt, like, really badly. Yep, yep, yep. Death. Death. Bad deaths. Uh, okay. How do I go around there, then? Maybe I drop down on this side instead? Let's try it. Let's just try to get down this area. Oh no, that area shows me where I last was. Okay. Let's hope I can get back over there. Oh, that's good. It actually lets me do that. Thank you. I'm honestly at a loss here. I can't seem to interact with this. Oh, maybe I need to punch it over it. Let's try that, shall we? Let's charge it up. Can't push it that way, can't push it that way. Hmm. Unless perhaps this is the only way that I can get the sort of distance I need? No, not even close. I do not see the way around this one. Hmm. I uh, keep dropping down those platforms. I mean, that one side of the platform, I'd already seen before. But we can try if you'd like. I'll probably die when, by doing it, but I'll certainly give it a shot. Like that. And then down here. Oh, wait. I think I know what you're t saying. Ah. That would be very clever if that were the case. That would be very clever if that were the case. Is it perhaps that I need to drop down from here? No. No, it's not. Okay. Ah. Wow, I just got spat out that time. <laughs> that was a bit harsh. I do not know. What's inside the pipe on the right of the tall ladder? Ah, let me have a look. Doesn't look to be anything. There's a ladder over there that I'm going to need to get to, but I'm not even sure how I'd move these cubes. Because I'm going to have to... Maybe I'm not meant to be here yet. Maybe I've just uh, come a certain way. And this is not the necessary location just yet. That's going to be my guess. So let's head out and continue exploring then. I can't drag the battery there, see champ? It... Uh, Stops me there. Uh, midway down. Oh, right. No, death. I see what you're saying now The to the right of the ladder. Yeah, just death. But it gets blocked. And yeah, you're right. It is sur surrounded by tiles. That are the the battery on the ledge that is surrounded by tiles that are equally dangerous to me. 
Uh, sorry, equally... Uh... Oh, I think I dodged it by being uh, hanging off the ledge. But uh, the tiles to the... Around this would stop me from pulling it over as well. Oh, no, actually, those tiles would allow me to push it off. If you notice, the lip is a little bit smaller there. But how would one get over there? I think I need an ability. I, I think I need to be able to go over these tiles. Yeah, I can't even roll over them. So I think I probably need to unlock something. Uh, let's see. Oh, it's pot like up to now, the only way I've been able to get past electricity is the walker. Could it be that the walker is needed again, perhaps? It's possible. Oh dear. Okay, that wasn't too bad, I suppose. Oh, really? No. I'm afraid not. You attack me this time. Oh, wow, I actually money for that time. Uh, can I move down here? No. Can I walk the walker off the cliff? No. No, it will not go. It refuses. Okay. That is not the direction that we need to go in then. Not yet. Let's wander in different directions for now. Can't get up there. Don't think we can get over there. Okay, we'll just drop this at the charging station then for now. There we go. And then we're gonna go wander. And then... This battery is currently charged. These into this little area that I don't really want to mess around with anything in. So I can slip by there to no way that I can go. Okay. Actually, let me just double check. No, I can go this way. Oh, okay. This might be somewhere we haven't been yet. Aha! Hello there. Where are we going to next, then? Up there, at that top area, just here, is where we really need to be. Go through there. Oh. around go up here we'll go between the electricity currents is there anything down here that I want no not particularly I mean the other thing is I could have to go to back to the areas I've been to previously in order to gain the uh, to make use of the um, bridge ability or the static ability, or really, I guess teleportation in a way, though it's not really teleportation, I wouldn't call it. Oops. Accident. Yeah, let's go and give that a try. So that seems a lot more likely to lead me to somewhere that I haven't already been. Nope, sorry. Not playing today. Don't want your hugs. Goodbye. Take it. Goodbye. Right. Let's use this to jump down there. Come on. Okay, right. Now, I don't remember the last place where I saw one of those things. Hello. I'd love to be able to turn this on for you. Uh, actually, there may be one up here. 
Because there are quite a few of them that I could see. Yes. Ah, it's not active though. I need to turn it on. Well, Drat, Dam, and Blast. Okay, so that scuppered my plans there. We may just have to puzzle it out in that area still then. Oh. Not in here. Take care, Shelly. Thanks for dropping by. How many... I, um, how much money have I got? I've got 48. No, I need quite a lot more to get there. See, the thing is, I can, I can maybe dash across that thing. But I can't think of any way that I can... Draw the block over it. And that's what I feel I need to be able to do there. Uh, let's go down this way if we can. No? No, we cannot. Okay. Very well. Back onto the walker and across the way we go. I can't take the walk into the vortex because it it's always blocked. There's some items there that are preventing me from getting any closer. And I can't get down here either. At least I don't think so. No, it won't let me walk it there, but I can use it to give me a shortcut over here. Now, there were a few things around this area, I think. Just a little ways further up. There is apparently this. Ah, yes, the, the little vista. Oh, you know what? That's moving. Did that move because I came close? In which case, it'll be moving down again, or did it just move because... Oh, no, there we go. Ah, just needed to wait. Oh, no, let me down there. I really want to jump. Oh. Well, that's a bit unfair, I feel. I feel that's a bit tricksy. Uh, I thought I'd found something, some sort of secret there. Okay, let me make sure that I've uh, actually activated this this time. Are there any places that I can use the uh, teleporter from on this area that I haven't already used? Because that could be another thing. Because I might need to use the teleporter. Any locations here? It's a shame they don't show up on the map. Ouch. That was my fault. I kind of feel like there's something here, but, you yeah, know, there's not. Right. There's these energized locations around here. They're not what I'm looking for. What I need is something very different. significance here. There's the ladder that goes all the way down. There's the ladders on the pillars over there, and that's how I get down there. There's this that I can't reach. I think that's part of a, a teleport um, chain. Genuinely confuzzled. I 
go over here. Ooh, is there anything back there? No. If I stand there, I get a little bit of a... A gander at things around the area. But none of this really helps me. Clearly missed something. Maybe the walker through the gate and activate the battery again. Uh, which battery do you mean, Isildur? The teleporters move when I raise that tower. I'm not sure on that one. Let me go and find out. That way it leads me down. Let's actually jump up and just use this again. Can I get up there? There we go. So I'm back all the way over here. Oh, Nathan Van. I'm sorry, Super Chat doesn't seem to work, but thank you so much for the tip there. It's very, very kind of you. Got the ladder over here. Have I been up here? Yes, I think I have. I must have, yes. I have indeed. So I've been through there before. This is where I gained the ability to use these things. So that's not it. Has to be something else then. It has to be something around here. Unless I'm just being really dumb. Which certainly isn't impossible. Uh, can I jump onto that block? No. It is a tricksy invisible block. But there we are. We've for science the, the, the vortex of doom. That is not, in fact, where I need to be. Where, the question is, where do I need to be then? Um, clearly, I need to be up and around that structure over there. Nope. Oh. Ouch. Scoundrel you. I'm not going to be petty and kill you. I am merely here to find the solution to my problem. I want to be over there, perhaps. I see no particular way of getting there. I don't think I've missed any... Oh, crap. I don't think I've missed any abilities, so... Clearly just something I'm not thinking about in how to use the tools that I currently have. So we just need to work out what it is that I'm missing. Down there seems to be where I want to be. In that little room with the uh, enemy over there. Have to get there though. He's a very, very different kettle of fish. Alright. Hey, Jordan. How you doing, mate? Alright, could it be that the blocking electrical field turns on if that battery block is removed? Uh, I could have a look at that. The pillars with a mage were looked like you could turn them around. Uh, sure, I'll head over there and give that a try in a moment then. For right now, I'm gonna head down here and we're gonna give the uh, we're gonna give a try of putting the battery back in and seeing if that removes the uh, electric field. 
Oh, the battery's back in, actually. Hmm. Something in what I've done has led me astray here, I think. I can't go in there to do any kind... To get up there at all, I need to pull this out. What? 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 Why didn't he do that before? What, 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 what? Shenanigans. Giant shenanigans. I guess that may have just been a bug earlier. That's my only, only possible um, conclusion. Either that or I changed something, but I'm fairly certain I didn't change something elsewhere. But that was a that was a bit of a bit of an interesting bug. Okay, we've got something over there that I can now interact with. Oh well. On the plus side, I mean yes, we we wasted a bit of time, but I discovered something interesting. We have made progress. Okay, so that's now active. Can I remove this? Looks like I can. Jumping into the vortex solved it, maybe. Maybe I pulled it out too fast, maybe. Could be right. But there we go. We're making progress again. Bugs notwithstanding. That's fine. It's, it's humming with power. Uh, I'm fairly certain that once this connects, all of the defense is turned back on. But I don't need this to be in there. That just opens up a door so I can jump back out. There we go. Hooray! Progress! Bet that has moved the uh, land up above around a lot. If that is the case, and I will say that it would have been really cool if there was like a shadow change. If there was one and I missed it, ah, it's because I'm I'm a dip. Oh, it has. Marvelous. What do I do here then? What? Oh, I like it. Oh, I liked it. That was good. That that felt pretty uh, pretty satisfying, I must say. Come on, then, Stompy. Let's go. In fact, something. Look, I'm gonna have to fight you one way or the other, so I may as well just deal with you now. Okay. No, don't want that, thank you. No, bad, naughty, naughty, bad. Yes, I will accept. There we go. Are you going to be able to hit me over here? No. Ha ha ha! We found the place we were meant to find! It just took us like an extra half hour, that's all. got a checkpoint. That is one thing that we've got down here, which is very good. We've also got a platform. And something I can activate. 
Do I want to? That is the question. Let us explore what we can do before I activate the thing. Sometimes it is very easy to activate something before you've checked everything else. But then you don't know what it would have been if you hadn't. If I was a game designer, I would absolutely hide a bunch of things in places like that. So they're like, oh yeah, I'm totally going to activate this thing because I've just found a switch. And I've also been told how to use switches. So you must want me to use the switch. Well, yes, to progress. But by having activated the switch first, you have now um, changed the lay of the land in such a way that you can't get the awesome item that was hidden just over there. Learn patience, my friend. I really like the music when we get those little vistas. Column over there. Can I just drop down? Yes, I can. No, no, I, I want to jump down. No, 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 no. I, I want to. No, 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 no. No. You're mistaken. No, you are absolutely mistaken. My, my intent is to jump down. Oh, it's not to jump down that far, though. My lord. He's trying to teach me for my hubris. There we go. I'm like, no, permanently missable items are fun for no one. Except for those who get them. And then they can be like, ha 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 I got the... Doozum or what's it. You did not. Because I am better at the game than you. Oh, hello. No, come back, little robot creature. Ah! Oh, dear. Oh. Why? Why did... Why? No, why? Why are you bleeding? Nope. Nope, please. Thank you. Nope. See, I didn't want to have to do this. Why did you make me? Wow. I wasn't even going to attack it. I was legitimately not going to. And... Instead, I intimidated it into committing suicide. I don't feel better about this. I don't feel like I'm the good guy in this situation. No. That was not a good guy thing. No. No, I know what you're going to do. No. Not this time. Uh, actually, I kind of wish you had, thinking about it. I would have liked the uh, extra stuff I could have gotten. Uh, let's go down this way. Hello? Ooh. Uh, no. I want to go in there first. We are going to explore this place as it was meant to be explored. Carefully. Thoroughly. Ew. Nothing in there. Okay. So it really wasn't meant to be explored like that then. Uh, what are we going to find around here? Hello? Goodbye. Right. I would like you. Wow. More health. It'll now take 0.5 more lightning bolts to kill me. Okay, what we got over here then? Now it is time to uh, Hulk smash, I think. Okay. No! But I wanted it. I want it so bad. Can I cause this to punch through again? Let me down. No, 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 no. No. What has happened to me? Oh. That was unfortunate. Hello. Okay, we're getting to a part of the game which uh, hasn't been as carefully tested, it seems. 
Ah, I see. Now they're connected. Cool. Has this gone somewhere new? No, same, same old place. I really like the aesthetic of this game. <sighs> right. Get up there. Thank you, Jackpot. Ooh. Hidden room. But I cannot activate. I can hear a little one of those robots being panicked. I mean, I just... I I wish it would just not immediately go from... Oh, no, you're not meant to be here. Let me, let me summon death upon you. If you would just give me a chance. You would learn that I'm, I'm not, not a scallywag. Oh, they've got a search mode. I guess I could sneak up on them. If I was a scallywag. Ooh. Thank you. Or I could just take the uh, higher path and go around them. And I think that is probably the, the right way to do it. Just try and get around you guys. Yep, like that. Nothing to see here. Absolutely nothing. Nope, no need to die. Ah, uh, Galawax. Uh, you know what? Fine. I actually do want to destroy these things because they were things. Ouch. Nope. Oh. Ha ha ha. Thank you. Ouch. <sighs> and you two are not complacent in this either. Uh, there we go. All my health back. Oh dear, another one of those, I guess. I'm not entirely sure I want to do this fight. It's a part of me wants to go back and... Like, I feel that we've gone far enough now from that original area that I do actually wish I had activated that, that block and spun things around. So let me go back. Before we get so far ahead that it's going to be a massive chore to go back. Charge! I'm not sure if Lady Shiab is still here. She may be recording at this point. Or she may be on the phone. Oh no, she's here. Maybe she have this very beautiful mod. Okay then, let's have a look. Oh. Oh. <laughs> ah, I should have tried that before. Okay. Okay. So I guess everything we're going to do down here is going to unlock uh, the uh, means for us to activate all of that. Get rid of that little uh, thing down there. There you go. Whoosh. Whoosh. Okay. Right then. Where have I gone? I was hiding for some reason. Okay. Let's pop through. Well, I haven't seen anything like that um, myself, c Champ. but then again, I, I'm watching the game. But uh, thank you to anyone, uh, any of the mods that are dealing with that. 
And thanks for bringing it to people's attention as well. That's the nice thing about the Daplings. They're self-policing. Alright, okay. I guess I'm going to have to have a bit of a, a bit of a showdown, aren't I? Yes, I am. Alright, well, that's fine. Because, at l the very least, you're going to let me get all my... Uh, my health back by summoning these things constantly. Anything back here? I wonder if I only partially destroy these things if it's better for me. No thanks. You gonna come over here? Yes, you are. Ouch. Nope. Nope. No thank you. Oop. Just try and break this while I'm here. Just a little bit. No, come back with my health pop. Scalawag. Thank you. Let's jump back up here. Just break that down as much as I can. Ah, oh, that was not what I meant to do. Oh well. At least I made the point this time of... Uh, Making sure the enemy was in a place that I could easily reach. Yeah. Nope. Thank you. Nope. Looks like that's their only attack when I've uh, destroyed the towers that they're getting charged from. Oh no. That was Oh really? Well, I I mean I suppose it's not that inconvenient considering. I like that there's a different animation every time as well though. That when you come out of the uh the pod, there's a different animation for your character each time they've done it. Alright, we wanna be over there. We do wanna get out there though. How can I? That area right there seems important. Can I get there in any way? Yes, this would be the time to for science! No, I cannot. Oh well. Yeah, gravity is definitely one of my greatest foes. Hello, Peter. I'm back. Been watching you for two years now, but this is the first time I've caught a stream. I hope you enjoy it. Uh, by the way, everyone, if you are finding it hard to get me to notice any messages that you're sending through, do be sure to include um, my name in the message, because that'll make it a lot easier for me to see. Ah, I wonder. I wonder, is it possible for me to jump across from here? I don't think it is, but let's give it a try anyway. Perhaps stepping stones? No, I don't think so. Oh well. Meow. You need to get going, Sea Champ. Oh well, thank you very much for dropping by. I really hope you enjoyed the, the stream. It'll probably be going for another eh, 20 minutes to an hour. Well, depending on when there seems to be a good cutoff point. Uh. Oh, we're going to have to rotate things around there, I think. Oh, I like this place. Yes, most certainly. Very loud, though. Can I get through there? And is there any point? Yeah, it looks like there is. Ah, battery, of course. I really am liking these puzzles. They are pretty, pretty solid little puzzles. There we 
Ja. What? Well, I've got to get across there. Oh no. It's terrible. There's no way. No way. No. Yeah, okay. Well, at least I now see what I need to do. So what I need to do is time it so that this um, bridge is going to be right there ready for me to go. So about now. Oop, that was wrong. Wrong button. Okay, that takes a lot longer than I was expecting. Might still be able to make it, though. Uh, if I can get up the ladder in time. Come on. Run, 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 go. Ha-ha! Perfecto. Uh, can't use this yet, though. Hello. So what be you? Ah. Uh. Okay. Well, for the time being, I can just go around it. But... Clearly, my objective is to pull this back out of the way. There we are. Awesome. Okay, I understand it now. I want to sell off, though. I'm really liking these puzzles. I, I'm genuinely, genuinely enjoying these. I, 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 I enjoy puzzle games in general, but... No, these ones are really well crafted. They're not too hard, but they're intricate enough to give you something to sink your teeth into. Whoa. Okay, let's go. Oh, it's a generator. It's a massive generator. Oh, that's pretty cool. Oh, look. Oh, maybe it's, a, maybe it's more of a ball. Oh, I'm not sure. But that looks amazing. The other thing I like about this is that the puzzle is very visual. We can now activate this. Oh, that's cool. That is actually very cool. Aha. Back up top. I see. What did this one do again? If anything. Ah. Right, I get it. So this will now allow me to get up there. I can just use this to take me back. Very snazzy indeed. Oh, we're going higher. And now we have our path through the area. Oh, that was awesome. That was awesome. You know what that reminded me of? That reminded me of the kind of dungeons in Dungeon Siege 1. The kind of intricate design of the dungeons in Dungeon Siege 1. Back then is when I think that uh, that development studio was on top of its game. The, the dungeons had a, a sort of... Well... People will often 
um, say that, that this is a quality of Dark Souls where the map is is like a spider's web of, of locations and nodes around this spider's web and, and you can connect each one um, by going a certain path and you unlock a shortcut which suddenly means that instead of having to go this long walk around the whole perimeter of the castle you can just go up a ladder and so on and so forth but uh, Dungeon Siege 1 had so many little secret areas and, and, and paths around the dungeons. Like, whoever did the level design there, or whatever team did it, they were genuinely on top of their game. Um, I'm, I wasn't as impressed at the later Dungeon Sieges. Um, I, th I think that series, one or maybe two, was where the series was at its, at its strongest. But, uh, yeah yeah definitely this that's i've been trying to think what is it what is it that this game is reminding me of and it's dungeon siege the the really intricate way that it all works together but uh that me geeking out over all games aside i've got to get a little bit further on but for the time being what i think i would like to do is return home and increase the power of my punch I don't know if that's really the best thing to do though because I'm wondering if maybe by increasing the power of the punch it's meaning it more as an offensive ability. I'm not sure I'm too into that. Womp. I'm jumping through here. Quickly activate this. And by quickly, I mean slowly. We can't get the Sprite Cloak for a long time, regardless what we do. But we can increase the power of our punch. Sounds a little bit more powerful. And Nathan, there may well be some more uh, Steam World dig in the future if people are interested in it. Uh, oh, locking onto enemies. I've not actually noticed that. But uh, you did ask me a little bit earlier how many more sponsors until I can get more emoticons well I, I've already unlocked one because we were on like 29 and I needed to be 30 but I will quickly go and have a check for you as to how many we are away from 40 which is the next one. Oh, we're actually on 40 so yes we ha we have two new emoticons uh, sorry emojis that I can I can get on there now so one of them will be Kapoi and the other one, I'm not sure yet. Like I said, probably a, a heart with a top hat on. Um, the next one will be in 10 um, sponsors time. And that'll be the 50th sponsor, and then that'll unlock the, the next one along there. Oh, that's awesome. Thank you so much, everyone. It is so incredibly kind of you how much you've been supporting the streams. Right, back to the game. Oh, <laughs> thank you. Dwayne Taresh, very uh, thank you very very much for for sponsoring the stream and the channel as a whole. Really, it's it's not really specific to the streams. It it affects the whole channel. It's just you tend to be able to see the uh, immediate returns on that in the streams because you get a little funky badge. I've actually um, fed back to them that I think that would be really, really cool to include in people's comments as well. That people would have that ability to comment with those badges. Um, as I feel that that would um, really give more value-added stuff to those who, who sponsor the channel. I'm not sure if I'm going to be playing Total War Warhammer yet. I might do. But I'm undecided as, as yet. Sorry, I don't, need, I don't mean to be down here. I don't want to kill you if I don't need to. Well, except for maybe you. Whoop. Oh, wow. It knocks them down. That is awesome. Okay, the, the punch really, really has some extra power now. 
Right, so we've been up there, we've been down there. The last place for us to go is over here. I think. Is it? Or is it not? Um, it actually isn't, really. When you think about it. Oh, wait. Wait, 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 wait. I think what we can do now is bring the walker. Ha ha! Fantastic! Here we go. Ah, uh, yeah, the the way that um, sponsorship works, it's not on the, the main YouTube site yet. It is only on the YouTube gaming site for the time being. It is a bit of a potch there, because uh, not as many people... Uh, actually go to the YouTube gaming site. Certainly if you're just subscribed to my regular YouTube channel, you'll have likely just seen this advertised and um, be watching from there. But I believe you can actually click to choose to um, watch on YouTube gaming. Uh, let's stop right here. Because there's something over there I want to activate. Okay. Oh, I've turned all the uh, electric fields off. That's quite useful. You can barely hear me at a time, so I do apologize. I can speak a little bit louder for you. I got a bad habit. Of, as the stream goes on for longer and longer, I, I slump back in my chair a little bit more. <laughs> That's basically what it is. Uh, yeah, I, I don't need to kill you, so let's not. I mean, you're worth cash monies to me, but... Nope. Can I? Oh, wow, that was actually quite useful. Oh, they're not active. And it's down on his back. Oh, so it's the... Uh, I can just stun them and then kill them very easily. That's very good. Let's see if I can get you out here so I can fight you. I want to see if that's true of even the large ones. Oh, you're a little bit of a stronger one. How about you? Yep. Yep. No. I'm going to need a much larger charge on my punch, I think. Like that. Yep. Hello. wonder if they'll hurt each other. Oh, my lord, that's so funny. Well played. Ouch! Not not well played. Badly played. Minimal approval. Okay, that's your armor gone. And nope. I need to let my charge return. You know what? Maybe I'll just attack you. Wow, fair bit of swordsmanship there. To be fair. Yep. Marvellous. You can just beat each other up for a bit. Oh, that's brilliant. I approve. That punch really has a lot of wallop now. Wow. Okay. Does watching this on YouTube gaming help you more than regular YouTube, or is there no difference? Um, there's no real difference from, from my perspective. Um, YouTube gaming is the only place where the sponsorship button exists, but other than that, I, I'm not actually sure that there's any difference between the two on, in terms of where you watch. Um, I'm not aware of any metric that is um, recorded that um, like YouTube is happier if people watch on a certain site than others. Um, so really, I'd say whichever is more comfortable for you, honestly. I will say that I actually find it more comfortable to watch things on YouTube gaming. But that's really down to personal preference. Okay, I see. Womp. Womp. Right, what have we got down here? Ooh, we have got 
Ah. Huh. Okay, that's useful, I suppose. Will that ever go away? Is there any point back there? I can't tell. Uh, kind of is. Ah, scallywags. Unless I can punch through this. No, I cannot. Ow, it hurts, it hurts. Burns, it freezes. Burns and freezes. Ah, poop. Fairly certain death is my only reward for coming here. I'm alive. Alive. <sighs> All right, then. Let's head back the way we came, I guess. Oh, that was, that was taking my life in my own hands there. We'll wait. We'll be patient. Yum, the old falcon. Sit a tea. And up we go. Womp. Ooh. I see down there a broken column. We missed one secret on the the big engineering area. Can I activate that? Oh, I can. Only I don't particularly want to right now, because that will kill me. Let's go make sure that that is turned off. But at least we're going to be out of this this wretched biome. It's really not conducive to my continued being aliveness. Uh, why? Why would you? Why would you do this to me? Have I not been been good and kind? <sighs> well, let's hope that this doesn't kill us because I think it probably will. Ah, uh, yeah, yep, death, 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 death. Not too surprised, mind you. Ah, that's why it enabled me to just turn her off there. I see. Useful. Um. Hmm. Thanks for that, Shelab. I could park the walker at the bottom, actually. That's a good call. Good, yeah, very good call. May well be what I need to do. Oh, butterflies. Yeah, it looks to be uh, draining all the power. Oh, fantastic. Fantastic idea. Thank you very much. There we go. Actually, this is not where I want to be. There we are. Go up this way instead. Womp. And just move some things around a little bit. There we go. Perfect. All right. Okay. Onwards then. Well, if we go up the ladder anyway. Now we can get this all the way around. want is to get in there which is probably what the uh, lever at the top is going to do such a pretty world this game has no nope, the other way there we go there we go oh 
hopefully we can access that place. It may want me to get some sort of sweet spot in the middle, though. No. Uh, well, actually, yes, it was. Okay. Um, I think. Let me see this. Was it a better place? No. I probably just need to bring it half of the way back. And it's probably got something to do with the uh, clicks that you can hear. Around, maybe about there or something. Can't quite tell. We'll go and have a look. I might be in the right place now. Yeah, perfect. Oh, wow. That down. Oh, okay. No, my walker. Why? Oh well. Looks like we've powered up the universe. To what end, I couldn't tell you, but looks like that's what we've done. Can I, can I step into the light? No. I cannot. I am not a moth. Let's have a look. Oh, wrong. Nope. Back. Oh, we gotta go back there. Okay. Well, that's useful then. Just follow back where we came. We've already turned off the electronics. That's why we had to turn that off. I was wondering why we would have shut that down. Actually, can I send it? Oh, that's pretty. Mm. It's definitely a very... There's definitely been a lot of thought and time being put into the game's appearance as well. Because this could just be a puzzle game, but it's not. It's a pretty puzzle game. Alright, let's head on over here. No, there was another place you needed to walk. Th use the walker. At least it looked like it. You walked over there before. Behind the... Hmm. I'm not sure then, Zangiri. I have no idea what location you could be talking about. Hello, my friend. Ah, oh, fantastic. It's powered up. Marvelous. Now, what can we do? Ah. No. Aha. So what do we do now? Hmm. I feel like you're waiting for me to do something, but I'm not entirely certain what that something is. Oh, I see. <laughs> yes, I see it now. Oh. That looks like a very interesting place to go to. I'm really liking this. So, so far, well, we've got something over there we still need to do. But we might now be able to do it, thinking about it, because of all the various things we've unlocked. There's a couple of things like that down there I still want. Oh, no, that's a, like a vista. Never mind. That's fine then. But there's this area over here that we have yet to see. But now that we've brought power here, maybe everything else is going to be um, powered on in this area. But the next destination for us... Oh, that looks like a giant hand. Is over there. Okay. Oh, this is brilliant. I like it a lot. Whoop. And, whoop. And, of course, the power. Perfect. Oh, another vista too. Let's have a nice long look. 
So that's where we just were. That whole area is just where we were. This is another thing that I like that does kind of harken back to Dark Souls more than something like um, Dungeon Siege. Is how you can see the places you've been. How you can see the whole world. And it's just more of a puzzle of like, oh, there's that wonderful building over there. That looks really impressive. And then later you get to that building. And it, it kind of has that feel here as well. And it's just so, so lovely. Such a fun game, this one. But I think that's going to be it for the stream for, for now. So let's head on back to uh, our, our uh, little home. And that's where we're going to wrap it up for tonight. I am quite interested in streaming this again. In fact, I'm quite interested in streaming this to its conclusion. Uh, if you are also interested in watching that do let me know down below oh this is a long place let me go to the right place but uh yeah either let me know in chat right now or uh in the comments when the when the vod goes live oh you're back over here uh, okay that's fine i was expecting you to be stood out there gazing gazing stoically out over the cliff until i managed to get there but uh yeah really really enjoyed tonight's stream and thank you so much to everyone who has tipped who has sponsored and everyone who's just hung out and, and chatted in in the chat it's, it's it makes streaming a really really pleasant experience just you know not streaming to yourself <laughs> it's one of the the chief things that that's nice about streaming over just recording video content sure i can generally do better quality because i can edit and there's there's a pleasure to be had in that but there's there's just something about having interactions with people and being able to share that moment at, at the same time with other people because of course i have those moments where i've discovered something cool in a video and then others will as well but they'll watch it at a different time so you're not really there and you don't see the chat light up for a moment with with people being excited or when you know i accidentally ground pound some poor little rodent with a flower tail I mean, there's pros and cons, I guess. <laughs> but that's going to be it for me. So thank you once again to everyone who stopped by. Everyone who has definitely, everyone who is who's sponsored or, or tipped, because that, that certainly helps. And uh, I will see you in the next stream, which will probably be around Wednesday time, I imagine. But until then, and as always, take care, everyone. <laughs>